Ah, the it's bells. chaos. The bells, Tristan, those terrible bells. They're ringing because bad, there's a punch up with beef eaters and other men of some <laughs> kind. Uh, 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 run away. I'm oh. helping you. Why don't you help him like you help those other two good guys and murder the. Ah! Guys? Yeah, you idiot. Just, just, just get out of there. Don't kill him. He's just doing his job. Leave me be. All right. <laughs> You're an assassin that can climb things. Oh, don't kill me now. Kill me now. <laughs> Your support is always appreciated, young Thomas. <laughs> if you then died from fall damage. Oh. <laughs> oh. Quick, get on the boaty McBoaterson. Wee. Are we going to have another fun cutscene with, <laughs> with piano mix shootings? Yeah, I'm a shoot face. Oh man, look at all those Union Jacks. This was probably the most British place in Britain. Well, there's London Tower, so I'd assume so. Ah, uh, yes. I killed her. What did you steal? Ah, uh, that necklace that we got from the weird little area. Like, in the clock tower. Is that Shooty McStab head? That is. You supplied me with the means to secure London's future. The city thanks you. The order thanks you. I thank you. Thank you. The child can only be worn by one. You know she's dead, sir. I hereby dissolve this partnership. I promise to endow you with an income into your old age. That is the most I can do. May the father of understanding guide you. <laughs> you know she's dead. Oh my god, that makes this so much easier. I think that's about to happen. Miss Thorne, sir. What of her? I'm sorry, sir. She is dead. Oh no. That's bad. <laughs> Damn it. Back. Back. <laughs> <laughs> Even if I have to raise hellfire to do it. Burn the letter. He's he's just standing there like oh, uh, <laughs> I'm T posing, sir, I apologize. His vision is based on movement. If I don't <laughs> move, he won't shoot me. <laughs> Bang! Bang! Yes, boy, yes. All right, cool. Now, time to do more missions. After more, I get More this. mission, more bitches, more money. After I get this. Yay! Ooh, fancy. That does look quite spiffing on me. That looks pretty good. It looks like Assassin's Creed punk rock, uh, flannel punk rocker, actually. No, I admit, all of these outfits look like they belong in a D&D character. They really do, though. Like, that's a rogue right there. <laughs> ah, horse! Possibly even a warlock, maybe, depending uh, on how you were playing that. Sure. So, I guess we played D&D is what's on your mind. Yeah. Um, yeah, we played yesterday, didn't we? Yes, we did. I was going to do this yesterday, but then... Yeah, <laughs> we're like, oh, shit, we've got D&D today. I uh, guess I'll do that instead. Yep. Work, work, work. Hey, it is kind of, because I wanted to get work done. No, that's fair. But I'm glad that we went, and it wasn't a super long session either. No. Um, it was a fun session as well. I'm glad we were not away for that. Yeah, that's true. Well, especially because, you know, I'm a bard character, and, the ca and we're starting off on a fucking talent show. I'd yes. be pissed if I missed that out. Oh, that was so much fun. All right, so that's apparently not... Ah... Uh, uh... Not what? I was going to do the fucking leap of faith, but apparently the game decided not to do that, so that's oh, fine. Wow. That is fine with me, game, you bastard. But yeah, no, um, in our D&D game yesterday, you, the bard, um, Seems a letter has come for <clears throat> sorry, but yeah, yesterday in D&D, you, the bard character, mm -hmm. you came second in the talent show, um... And our fighter came first. Oh, yeah. Because he pulled off some awesome trick shots by shooting in 
an apple off somebody's head with a with a, uh, a heavy crossbow, dropping the crossbow. He, he rolled real well, so the, the first bolt split the apple in half, and then he pulled out two hand crossbows and pinned those two halves of the apple to the wall. Oh, uh, yeah. Also, I swear we did this bank thing. I can't remember at all. I'm going to be honest, at this point... Oh, that's what I'm point, doing currently, that's I right. I have stopped paying attention to this game. Good! Nope. Ugh. But yeah, and then we got teleported to another dimension where we got uh, TPK'd. Yes, we did do that, didn't we? Yes. Hurrah! We all died. But that then was we were fun. immediately brought back to life because it was something the DM was planning. Oh yeah, that's right. It, you know, it was one of those... Did something just crash into our house? No, it's wind. Uh, it felt really strong for wind. It's wind, Thomas. All right, cool. Yes. Um, that yeah. was an interesting end to that session, I think. It was really cool. I like the, the DM's reasoning as well for what he did. So he fight, pitches against, like, a 25-foot-tall bone, bone golem, golem construct thing, thing um, which fucked us up. Like, yeah. again, it, t it total party killed us. Um... It took me a real while to understand what the fuck you were on about when you said that, by the way. Oh, when I was chanting TPK. Yeah, you just kept on saying TPK, 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 because I was excited to see what would happen if we all died. <laughs> the game's over, and then just the fucking DM just, like, does that with it, which, like, it just throws all the things off the table, like, you fucking morons! Yeah. No, he didn't do that. It was one of those, if we defeated the thing, then fuck yeah. And we got it down to 20 hit points out of, what, 200? Out of 200. It was we're, like a level, it's difficulty level 6 and we were level 3. Yeah, we're, we're all on level 3. Um, but yeah, and then he had, you know, some knights of the area come through and defeat it, the rest of it, res us, and then I think we're supposed to have, like, months in training to <laughs> we had a training this. montage well we haven't had the training montage yet it's just that this is what's going to happen next session by the by you're all level six now so jump yeah. from level three level six which that is an enormous leap that's a great a huge leap but it's also a bit of a pain in the ass to get working again yeah but oh well but the, the, the dm's reasoning being that he's going through the monster manual and he wants us to fight Really these cool shit. Awesome, cool monsters, but he can't because we're too lower level. And I think that's actually a really good reason to just bump up your characters while also giving us just just um, decking us out in equipment that has plus two to everything. Yeah, exactly. Um, and I think if I do start a new game for whatever reason, whenever that might be, I'm probably going to start the party at level five or something. That makes sense. Uh, just because. I've started so many games where we all started at level one, and so you know that you're fighting kobolds and goblins and half orcs. And orcs <laughs> We're very and shit at our job. The occasional wizard, wizard. and I'm um, so yeah. There's more interesting things to fight, and I guess if you keep getting caught in that starting a new game from scratch loop, if you generally if you're only going to get to level five because sometimes that's just how games go. Yeah. Then you're fighting the exact same shit, you're playing with these same abilities every time. You never get to experience that high level tiers of play. Which I've Fair. Ne which I've never gotten to do yet, because I've never had a game where our characters got over level five. True, but you're um, already experiencing it in our current game. Which one? The one that you're running. But only starting to. Oh, true. You know? Like, you've only just all reached level five. And I think some of you haven't quite got there yet no not yet um so yeah but yeah so it'd be fun to do yeah fair enough like i'm interested to see where it goes well, oh yeah what say you you're not gonna like it no see you <laughs> what say you why? apples and cheese and pears why constitution two pennies rob in the bank of england <laughs> the governor of the bank I think you need to sit down. There's no time for that. Bar is really deep in the vault by now. However you get in, I don't want to know. Of course. But do you know how I can get in? Because I'm not that smart. That's my sister's job. I just suddenly realised this is a bad idea for me to be doing this. I can, like, punch the vault off, right? <laughs> As like, as like, that's Can my I plan. stab the vault? That's like my plan, right? Is I'm going to walk in and I'll punch it. Oh, wow, we're doing two of these in a row. Fucking hell. Mr. Osborne, only he is allowed free access to the vault. You can spot 
spot him near the entrance. Just start playing the Ocean's Eleven themes. Just like a low bass in the background. The music in Ocean's Eleven is so good. Good lord. It is definitely bass heavy. Okay. I'm gonna be honest, the- ah! What? Did you not see that with his neck? No. His neck kind of did this thing where it went on a weird angle, like its head was straight, but his neck suddenly went <laughs> Yeah. No big displays. This is the Bank of England. If you encounter any trouble, I'll be in the atrium. In disguise. Sir, stop disguising yourself. You're shit at it. I'll be in the atrium in disguise as a lady again. Hello! <laughs> What an interesting chap he is, indeed. So I guess it's giving you three ways to do the mission. Well, we did the unique kill last time. Do we want to do a different... Fuck no, the unique kills are interesting. All right, cool. We've also done the unique kill, like, every time, so we might as well just keep that train going. All right, climb that cock. Yeah. I got on the ham. Yeah. I feel like cock ham should be an insult. Why? I don't know. Like, when I think of ham, I think of, you know, the kind of, like, Australian department store deli ham, which is this tasteless, thin, floppy bit of watery meat. Ugh, now that you say it like that. Yeah. Alright, so we're gonna grab this dude. No, he got, he's got a dick like a Woolworths packet of ham. Mmm. It's not even a Woolworths packet of ham. At least that's fresh. You gotta go for like. No, it's not. It's Woolworths. Yeah, but you gotta go for that. You gotta go for that fucking pre-packaged ham, though. Oh, I mean, like in those sandwiches we had yesterday. Yeah, that was was so disappointing. That cafe does a really nice coffee and cake, but those sandwiches were garbage. Where's just this entry point big old thing there? of stale bread with like a, a, a sliver, a sliver of fucking um um. Pastrami or whatever the hell it was I had in yeah. the sandwich. And just dumped with like this watery butter. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Sneaky Don't sneaky mind me, it's the Bank of England. Hello. Alright. Alright, now kidnap the head of security. Oh, I got that already, so... Uh, oh, that is him? I think so. Alright, we'll keep that radius low. Alright, so find the secret passage. Stop it. Actually, you know what? I think I have a skill for this. Yeah? What is it? Uh, this one. No longer try to escape. Buy it. Done. I don't know if it'll work in the mission we're currently doing, but never know. Oh, fancy. Fitting for two pennies too. Ooh. Fancy threats. Oh, you better not fucking do that when I get close, you asshole. Oh, he will. You know he will. He will. I'm just going to wait for him. There we go. Okay, go. Wait. Okay, there we go. Go. <laughs> They're just looking at him going, Yep, that seems fine to me. Don't, 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 don't. Oh. Very sneaky, sir. Alright, that was the place I was meant to. Yeah, no, that's right. So... It's just downstairs some more. Okay. Da 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 da. Um... You probably can't just let him go, can you? No, I think he's got a. Hey! Hey! Unless I just. Unless he just, like, immediately just lets get, gets let go yeah. after this point. I mean, you could knock him out and hide him in that cupboard upstairs, but I think you need him to get in. Yes, I'm gonna say. Yes, I'm going to say that. Let's go with that. Okay. Um, did he just evaporate? Yes, he did. Oh, good. 
All right, so I've got to get to this. Hide behind a painting. <gasps> oh. Do, 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 do. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fuck. You didn't push X quick enough. I did not. Hide the body. Good point. Also, there's a guy over there. Go. Don't Go. hide the body. Damn it, that's not gonna work. Okay. You're gonna hide the body in there. Well, that's true. After I hide this body. Bonk. Yee. Yeah. Right, come on. Up a day. Up a day. There you go. Up a day. There you go. Oh, someone's tired from a big day out, isn't he? <laughs> there you go, buddy. It's okay. Oh, no. All right. So, you can't just kill that person that's your target, right? You want to find the secret passage? Yeah, I would like to do that. Okay. Although, I get the feeling I might have fucked this up already, but I don't How? know. I have no idea. But you know what? It's me. I'm playing this game. So if you can assume something's gone wrong, something's probably gone wrong. <laughs> there you go. It's time for naps. Nap time. I had a big day of being murdered. <laughs> Jesus. How do I... I'm going to get down there. Fucking hell. I'm pretty... I don't know, I get the... Because you're in the vault. Like, there's gold everywhere. There's gold a lot of places I'm pretty sure here. that the secret passage was somewhere else, and you've just kind of... Ah, fuck it then. Fuck it. Who don't... Let's just kill this dude. Yeah, and you've just sort of strolled in because you kind of had that guy as cover, I guess. No, yeah. No, no, no. Yeah. Right there. Yeah, I know. Then why are you saying, uh... I'm just expecting that you'll screw it up somehow. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Alright, and stop. Up. Get up! Oh. oh, you're good at this. Did it. Yay. Uh. <laughs> You've stolen your last Money! Those animals squander their savings. We are the experts in investment. Nothing would be built or improved. Nothing would rise above... Damn them for putting their money in a bank. Damn them for buying things that makes them enjoy life. <laughs> Dude, you run a fucking bank. <laughs> Don't... F <laughs> I'm creating the future with money. You, you run a bank. That's all you do. You literally just run a bank. Wait, shit, that was my last shit. Oh, damn it. Do we know why they wipe the blood away? No. I think it's just as a proof of death, proof of contract thing, maybe. What but contract? I don't know. All right. And counter. And counter. And stab. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Right in the bowler hat. I can't see. There we go. The thing about the enemies, right, is that they're black. And the thing about the, uh... You might want to be very ooh, careful about your next words just, there, Thomas. I just... Wow. I, I was trying to quote Red Dwarf, oh. not realising oh. that making the, uh, uh, the subject of the, the blackness uh, human beings might be problematic. Let's just... Stop let's digging, just... Thomas. Just let it be. The original quote is about black holes. I'm right. in the restricted... What do you want, game? It's up. What are you trying to do? What are you trying to do? I just said, find the secret passage, and I thought that was the secret passage. Well, then it wasn't the secret passage, was it? Okay, fine. I'll just get out of here. Fuck Actually, it. No, 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 no. Turn around, turn around, turn around. Go back down, go back down. What? Isn't it uh, to the uh, left? This way? Yeah, down one of those passages. Maybe. Nope, nope. This one? Oh no, this is like the, the hiding spot, so it was like we could well, jump no, out of a well, painting. It was there, wasn't it? It was back there, behind you. No, go back into the room, please. The room? Don't make fun of my fucking accent. 
It's there's nothing here. Like, okay, all right. Sorry. That's what I'm saying. That was, that, that was the unique kill opportunity. I don't think that's what they were after. All right. Oh, uh, I swear the game just told me to go here, but apparently not. We'll activate your thingy. Uh, like I'm not blind. The game did actually tell me to get in the lift. See, I didn't actually see it say tell you that. So maybe you are blind. All right, fine, maybe. Let's just go out the like the top way, I guess. Like that seems like the smarter move. More dudes, but at least I'll get out. Ah, ha ha! Yeah, let's just Wait, there's like happens. 17 people watching the door. Yup. Unless I do something smart and fancy, like... Punch! Do 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 do. Bye! Yup. Whoops. Someone's committed a bank robbery, and it was me! Wee! Wee! Right. We're good? Area. Are we good now, game? Are you, you done? You gotta escape the area. Just let... there. Escape the area. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> um, sure thing, Jacob. I can't zip climb without me hat! Woo! Arrest them all for robbing the people of England. What? <laughs> Wait! I don't. Inspector? Wait, it's arrest them for robbing the people of England. Can we do that to like other banks? Can we, can we do that? <laughs> oh, we can do that? That's cool. Alright. <laughs> That's right. I'll kill the man. Oh well. Fuck it. Oh well. Cool. Okay, well, thank you for watching. Oh, oh, we're going to the future. Ugh, I hate the future. <laughs> Future's garbage. Well, I don't know, we get to see uh, British person McGee that you love so much. I don't love him, he's just mildly interesting amongst the turgid, random brownness. Ah. Brexit's happening soon! <laughs> Not soon enough, ask me. Upon my honour. Your honor carries little weight. How dare you, sir? The poor people. I'm hefty at best! Ha! <laughs> Today I granted a significant rise to my staff in order to counter inflation. What? I would supply all of London if I could. Meanwhile, you sit in your club and wax poetic with promises uh -oh. your honor cannot. Ah, the knife! The melee version of a gun. Your family's fortune, however. I wonder what they would offer to keep your record out of the newspapers. About the same as Disraeli would offer. I have absolutely no idea what this guy's on about. I don't know who this other person is. I'd cut off your nutsack, though. We can have it all. What say you, sir? Ah! Collect. Your testicles. Was that clear enough for you? Or was it... I'm, go I'm going to cut off your balls. <laughs> they belong to me. Understood. It's metaphorical. I own you. you may see yourself at it. Ah, the cup. The drinking version of a gun. <laughs> <laughs> ah, sipping. The bodily fluid version of a gun. <laughs> just puts it on. just like, this looks cool. <laughs> <laughs> a letter. For me? <gasps> a letter? I can't Probably should see what this letter is. Can't read it. It's not in crayon. <laughs> Why isn't it made of pictures? There we go. A letter for me. Oh, Clifford the Big Red Dog. God damn it. Okay, cool. So, thank you for watching this episode of Assassin's Creed. Uh, sorry, Ready Players Plays Assassin's Creed. As always, if you'd like to send us correspondence, you can send that to readyplaysletters at gmail.com. You can also find us on... <gasps> Facebook, Twitter, and SoundCloud, where you can also find our delicious podcast, which is also on iTunes, Stitcher, and TuneIn. And also, you can find us on Patreon, where if you send us some money, we'll send you some super cool stuff in return, such as early access to videos like these, early access to any bonus podcasts we do, as well as exclusive access to our little preambles before we do our podcast, where basically we talk about random stuff for about 15, 10 to 15 minutes while we set up the show that isn't necessarily a pl doesn't necessarily fit the tone of the show we already have. So... 
Awesome. Thank you very much, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye, guys. Bye. Bye.